Okay. Is this in the thing? <laughs> Come back behind your shoulder. So this is the Nada. <laughs> so this is the Natasha Dodona. I hope I'm saying it right because I love this stuff. This is the Holiday Collection 2017. I wanted to review it because I've seen it all over social media. I was like, oh, I have to have my hands on that because it's so sparkly looking. And here it is and I still can't move. But we're going to try it on Rachel and see if it works and see what I think. Let's go. Do it. All right, guys. So we're going to try out the Natasha Dodona Holiday Collection. Oh. <laughs> <gasps> what was that? Oh shit. It fell out. Sorry, Natasha. <laughs> it's on my shoe, so at least my shoe is going to look nice. But yeah, so I just took it out of the box and it broke. You know what? I'm just assuming that it's because they are very soft and blendable. But you know what? There's still a little bit left, so we'll still be able to see what it looks like. I already used a primer on her eye. I'm so sad that that broke because the color's so nice. So it's like the perfect, like, pinky like sparkly soft color I've ever seen in my life and I'm noticing that honestly there's really not that much fallout either fallout is when eyeshadow like falls down here you know sometimes you're putting on eyeshadow and it messes up your foundation there's really not much fallout which is amazing especially with the sparkly a sparkly a sparkly eyeshadow I'm going to use a little bit of this brighter color just to see what it is because it looks really pigmented Ooh. You know what's crazy? I've been seeing these eyeshadows online for like a year and I've never, I've always been like, it's pretty, but like, whatever. It's so good. It's so nice and it's so pigmented and a little goes such a long way. Don't be scared of bright colors because it's, it could be super bright, but it's how you apply it and it's how much you apply. Like you don't have to make your eye look orange. You could just put a little bit in the corners. I'm quite impressed. That's amazing for, for eyeshadows that are so pigmented and sparkly, that's so rare for there not to be like a ton of sparkle under the eye. So I'm excited about that. Just for like fun time, we're going to use this right under her eye. This one is a little bit less, um, less sparkly, even though it looks really shimmery. It goes on a little bit softer than I thought. But that's not a bad thing. It just gives you a little bit more of a natural look. As so natural, natural as like red eyeshadow can be. <laughs> And I'm going to use this super shimmery color, which I've been looking at for the past 20 minutes. And I want to see what it looks like. If it's anything like the first color and like texture, then I'm going to be obsessed and I'm going to order 16 of these. What's in... I realize that I should believe the hype sometimes. Like sometimes I'm like, oh, that doesn't work. They're getting paid to say that. They, I should believe people sometimes. Look down. This is amazing. It's super sparkly. It's super like peachy and pretty and it has like you could see the gold shimmer in it. Very very little fallout but the fallout that is there is is just shimmer so it doesn't even look bad. It's just like gold shimmer so I don't see anything wrong with that. I don't see anything wrong with that. <laughs> All right guys so now I'm going to try the other palette. So I'm going to use this nice pretty pinky peachy color. So pretty. What? What? <laughs> you know what I love? That whatever color you see here is what you see on her eyes. Like, it's not like, oh, it's not going to be that colorful. Like, it's exactly what it looks like, which is so cool. And honestly, on like darker skin tones like myself, you're going to get the same amount of pigment. Like, that's crazy. Don't mind my long fingers. <laughs> this one has a little sheen to it, like a little shine. So it's not blending as easily as the orange color I used on the other eye, but it's still blending like great. It's just not as easy. This palette has a little bit more fallout than the other palette did. I think it's because of like the sheen, it doesn't grab as easily. Not a big deal because you can add a little bit more concealer or you can do your foundation after you do eyeshadow. I'm gonna use this color right here. This color is amazing. Right here, this, get this palette just for that color. <laughs> See, so a little bit more fallout than the other palette. These eyeshadows are amazing. Like, no lie. They're a little expensive, not gonna lie. When I first saw it in Sephora, I was shocked. <laughs> I was like, okay, that's crazy. This is, it, eyeshadow can't be that expensive. If you buy something that's good quality, it's gonna last you a long time. A little goes a long way and you get amazing results. So I have a little sample size Chanel mascara that I'm gonna use on her and I just kind of want to show you guys that you don't always have to do eyeliner and this and that. 
You can sometimes do eyeshadow with a pop of color and do mascara and that's enough. This is the smallest eye mascara sample that ever existed. It's really tiny. <laughs> I could barely hold it. I'm like... So included in the holiday collection are these crystal top coats. Don't fall out. <laughs> Please. I'm like... Psh. So I'm just gonna... Ooh. <gasps> They're like little crystallized eyeshadows, like super shimmery. Ooh. Oh, this is crazy. This is not... This is not okay. What? Okay, so these... Whoa, they're so nice. It's like the finest little pigmented shimmer. These you can put over eyeshadow or even just use it by itself. It has a little color. This is called um, bronze. And then I'm gonna use this one called peach. This kind of feels like a powder gel. It's kind of smooth. So these are great. Like they're a good way to Add extra shimmer, basically. The shimmer is so fine, and so it doesn't look like glitter. It's just like shimmer. I love, I love, I love, I love, I love, I love. I'm obsessed. Not love, obsessed. And definitely worth it, for sure. So the Natasha Dodona eyeshadow palettes. Holiday palettes. I am a huge fan. I get why everyone loves them. I get why they're a little bit pricey. Um, they're super pigmented. They're gonna look good on any skin tone. I mean, there's just so much color payoff and the shimmers are amazing. They're really soft, which is a good thing, but also a bad thing because you have to be careful with the palette because any bang or if you drop it, it'll. I'm assuming it'll break. So I give these five chinchillas. <laughs> When it comes to the crystal top coats, I'm also a huge fan and I hate to, you know what? I want to give something four stars so bad. I want to give it three stars. And so I give these five chinchillas also. A little goes a long way. It adds extra sparkle. You can use them alone and the quality is really good. It feels like a gel powder. I'm obsessed with the holiday collection and I want them to make a holiday collection part two. Maybe. <laughs> but like in a week, like send it over, please. Um, I'm obsessed with all of this stuff and I totally get the hype. So that is my review on this. I hope it was helpful. Buy it and be obsessed with me and let me know what you think.